Let's take a look on how to integrate our Google Ads account with your Google Merchant Center and Google Analytics account. It's an extremely simple setup, yet it's very important that you do that because when you're running ads for your store, uh, your website, you absolutely need to have this data together. You need to have one platform talking to each other and exchanging data, especially Google Merchant Center with Google Ads because you need the products to be uh, uploaded correctly and you need the data to be shared. So all you gotta do is come here to your Google Ads account, your homepage. You're going to come to, to the settings. Here you're going to look to uh, link the accounts under setup. You just click link the accounts and it's extremely easy. So Google Analytics, you just click details. It's going to show you your Google Analytics account accounts created under the same email. So make sure to have the same email for when you create all your accounts. We have other videos going through how to create each of the accounts, Merchant Center, uh, Google Analytics. Uh, then all you have to do is look for the, the, the property, the correct property and click link. Once you click link, uh, you simply import everything and just click save. Both are going to uh, integrate together. So that's for the universal analytics. Now we go back and you're going to connect Google Analytics GA4, which is also something we created together in our Google Analytics creation video. All you got to do is, is come to details. Here you're going to see same thing, Google uh, Galeri Store GA4, your, your property is going to show here. Actions, you simply link and you import everything that you can. You really want Google Analytics talking to your Google Ads account. Now what we are going to do is you're going to connect a Google Merchant Center account. So for this, you're going to click here uh, and you're going to see Google Merchant Center. One thing you'll notice is that uh, for Merchant Center, you have to go to Merchant Center first, send a request, and then accept from here. So all you gotta do is come to your Merchant Center account, that's merchants.google.com. Here we're going to go to, which is also something we created together. You come here, uh, all you gotta do is come to link the accounts, same thing. Um, and here they are automatically going to recommend you your account because they are, uh, this account is created in the same email as the Merchant Center account. You simply go link, uh, it's going to create a request. Uh, account link needs to be confirmed in Google Ads. So now you go back to your Google Ads page. You can just do this, refresh the page. I don't think we need to refresh. Uh, yeah, we should refresh the page. Once you do this, you simply go back to Merchant Center and you are going to see one received. You manage, you click manage a link. Here you simply uh, view request and you approve the request. That's as simple as that. Uh, you have now your Google Ads account talking to your Merchant Center account in Google Analytics account. You have all the data available in terms of Google Ads traffic. So that's exactly what you need, okay? Everything is set up. You don't need to do this uh, anytime soon. Once set up, that's done. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all you need. Thanks so much for watching. We're going to have a lot of other tutorials on these little setups and also broader uh, questions in terms of Google Ads for e-commerce specifically. So make sure to subscribe uh, and stay tuned for the next ones. You're also going to see some videos on the left uh, or the right. I'm not sure where they show uh, with other setups. Also the Merchant Center and Google Analytics video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.